Well, good evening, good people. Mark Holmes here, and as always, I want to say thank you all for watching, commenting, subscribing, and being part of the Joe Boo Sports Report. Without you guys, as well as you ladies, you know that this literally does not work. Well, it's been a very, very busy day, a day that I did not think was going to be that busy. I thought it was just going to be Thirsty Thursday. And uh, the usual stuff as we get ready to take on the Seattle Seahawks. Uh, but that world was put upside down with Tyron Smith going down awkwardly and tearing his hamstring literally off the bone. Uh, Tyron Smith is set to have surgery tomorrow. And if he returns at all, it would be sometime late in December. Uh, so basically, the Cowboys have to figure out something different uh, to deal with, uh, to, to go with them, the Cowboys plan. Um, we've gone through, I've done a few videos and things about some different players and veterans we could be, bring in. Uh, there's all kinds of rumors out there like uh, Andrew uh, Whitsworth could be, you know, somebody the Cowboys could throw money at. We're going to hear all kinds of stuff. Um I'm hoping that the Cowboys have been bunkering in and developing a plan. Tonight is the season kickoff uh, for the Dallas Cowboys, and so they've got that event that's going on. And we have Tyler Smith, the first player that I've heard uh, say anything about the situation uh, going forward, and especially since it's definitely directly involves him. Let's go to the tape and listen to exactly what Tyler Smith had to say. Have they talked about you and left tackle at all? Or? I haven't talked about it yet, but okay. you know, the future, what, what the future holds is you know what the future holds for sure. Well, you bet. Obviously, you're, you're still going to be calling on you more than maybe you were two days ago. Right. I mean, how ready do you feel like for that opportunity? I mean, I was ready as soon as I walked through the door. You know, I knew as soon as I put my name on that piece of paper, you know, I would be held to a certain standard. You know, I'd be required to, you know, give certain parts of myself to it. So, you know, I'm ready for whatever comes ahead. You know, we're going to approach it day by day for sure. How's the ankle? But we're all good. We're good. Will you play Friday or no? No, we're not playing Friday. You don't play Friday. Okay. No. How, how disappointing is that to have that setback and you miss those reps? I mean, it was tough for sure, but, you know, it's part of the, it's part of the game. You know, it's a 100% injury business. You know, I'm fortunate that it's nothing severe and that I'll be back soon. But, you know, I'm just looking forward and taking it day by day. How comfortable would you be back going, be going back to your old position after working at left guard all camp? <laughs> I mean, I played left tackle for a while. You know, I couldn't give you an honest answer right now because, you know, I have been working guard since the preseason. But, you know, I'm, uh, you know, I'm ready. You know, I practice for this. You know, my coaches, Coach Philbin and Coach Blasco, they they prepare me for this. So I'll be ready right, when the time comes. Thank you. Thanks, thanks, Tyler. Tyler. All right, so he says his injury was nothing serious, um, that he's fine. Of course, he won't be uh, playing uh, tomorrow night um, for the Cowboys and asked whether or not he would be ready to play. You know, basically he's saying, I'm up for whatever. Uh, he doesn't seem to be nervous about the situation or panicking. Uh, basically, he said, you know, going back there, I've played tackle before. I've done work out basically exclusively at guard this season, but, you know, basically we'll do whatever. Um, I guess in some regard, it's better that this happened now. At least the Cowboys have a couple of weeks to prepare for life without him. And it's kind of poetic justice, I guess, that this is the six-year anniversary of Tony Romo uh, being hit by Cliff Averill and being knocked out, uh, basically the beginning of the end of his career, which gave Dak Prescott a shot to take the reins, in which case Rain Dakota Prescott never gave them up. Maybe this is history repeating itself, and maybe this is Tyler Smith's opportunity to shine and become the next Tyron Smith just a little bit sooner than we thought. Uh, let's listen to that just one more time before we get out of here. Have they talked about you and left tackle at all? Or? I haven't talked about it yet, but okay. you know, the future, what, what the future holds is you know what the future holds for sure. Well, you bet. Obviously, you're, you're still going to be calling on you more than maybe you were two days ago. I mean, right. How ready do you feel like for that opportunity? I mean, I was ready as soon as I walked through the door. You know, I knew as soon as I put my name on that piece of paper, you know, I would be held to a certain standard. You know, I'd be required to, you know, give certain parts of myself to it. So, you know, I'm ready for whatever comes ahead. You know, we're going to approach it day by day for sure. How's the ankle? No, we're all good. We're good. Will you play Friday or no? No, we're not playing Friday. You don't play Friday. Okay. No. How, how disappointing is that to have that setback and you miss those reps? I mean, it was tough for sure, but, you know, it's part of the, it's part of the game. You know, it's a 100% injury business. You know, I'm fortunate that it's nothing severe and that I'll be back soon. But, you know, I'm just looking forward and taking it day by day. How comfortable would you be back going be going back to your old position after working at left guard all camp? I mean, I played left tackle for a while. You know, I couldn't give you an honest answer right now because, you know, I have been working 
guard since the preseason. But you know, I'm uh, you know, I'm ready. You know, I practice for this. You know, my coaches, Coach Philbin and Coach Blasco, they they prepare me for this. So I'll be ready All right, when thanks, the time comes. Thank you, thank you, thanks, thank you. Tyler. All right, I'll be ready. Well, I hope so because our season may be depending on it. We'll bring you guys any more news that we get on the situation with the Dallas Cowboys. I'm Mark Holmes, and I'll see you soon.